Ladies and gentlemen, the press conference will now begin. Good morning, media friends. A very warm welcome to the Tata Motors Pavilion, the Tata Motors press conference at the Auto Expo has always been a momentous occasion. The products that were first announced here have gone on to become significant milestones in the progress of the Indian automotive industry. We are confident today that some of the revelations that you shall hear this morning and the vehicles to be unveiled soon will go on to add to this list of landmark moments. Moments that herald the coming of age of India as an auto market and Tata Motors as a full range mobility solutions provider. So let us begin without further ado.
Thanks, Elish, for this CP drive. It almost felt uh, like a flight experience. Much more smooth and silent, though. I'm sure the audience is eager to know more about the Nexon EV. Well, Gunter, the Nexon EV is India's own electric SUV. It's built on the state-of-the-art Ziptron technology, and definitely it has a zip about it, with the car having the capability to reach 0 to 100 in just 9.9 .9 seconds. It seems my comparison with an aircraft was quite valid. Wow, that's really electrifying. Not just that, the Nexon EV is high-performance connected vehicle that is uniquely suited to address the aspiration of Indian customers and break all the barriers of EV adoption. We are confident that this development will mark an important milestone in India's electrification journey and further reinforce our commitment towards developing sustainable and responsible mobility solutions for India. Um, that seems to be an interesting buy, but as a personal car driver and buyer, the first question is, what's about charging the Nexon EV? Well, we are unique as a Tata group by leveraging Tata Universe. We are not only providing an EV product, but also building the entire ecosystem around it. The Nexon EV, as you know, is powered by 30.2 kilowatt hour high energy density lithium ion battery pack that gives a phenomenal range of 312 kilometers wow. on a single charge. Further, we are offering a free charging unit with the Nexon EV to address customers' range anxiety. Of course, such a range suits my use case completely. However, today is the day we talk of a different range. We talk of uh, our extensive range of products which would stand up for every customer in every situation. Oh, yes. In that case, let you continue, and I'll get back to my Nexon EV drive. See you on the other side. See you on the other side. Have a safe drive, an electrifying one. Thank you. I think that's what Salish meant. We're going to meet on the other side. Namaste and welcome to the Tata Motors Pavilion. Today I would like to take you on a journey that is beyond your expectations. What you just saw truly encapsulates the theme of our pavilion, connected India, responsible and sustainable mobility solutions. And we believe that the future of mobility is SES, connected, electric, shared and safe. Spread across 6,000 square meters, this pavilion is going to surprise you and take you beyond our product display with engaging and exciting content and one of its kind experiences. For the first time ever, you will get an opportunity to be driven in a fully electric Nexon EV right here on our elevated track, specially designed to provide a unique and memorable experience. Log on to the Tata Motors Auto Expo web app, team about your products, learn about your products, technologies and solutions, complete the quiz, and become the winner of a Nexon EV test drive here and now, again, up here. Isn't that exciting? With the widest range of products, comprising of 26 BS6 vehicles, 14 commercial vehicle products, 12 passenger vehicle products, and nothing less than four global unveils. We have gone beyond BS6 by providing a fresh design to our products, coupled with cutting-edge technology and exciting features. Our pavilion truly exhibits our commitment to the environment with a mighty range of BS6-compliant products, along with the green cover on our stand. And it's a natural green stand. I invite you to touch the grass and to actually touch uh, the green of our vertical gardens. But that's not all. We also have innovative engagements across our zones, four zones, the connected zone, where you can experience connected technology features across our PV, CV, and electric vehicle range of products. 
the electric zone, my personal favorite, where you all just saw me having my sippy drive, not just the Nexon EV. You will find our full range of e-mobility solutions by our signature color, teal blue, across the pavilion. The single largest portfolio of electric vehicles, and this clearly is a testimony of our commitment to a green future. The shared zone, our vision of driving sustainable mobility solutions in people and goods transport is being translated into action through multiple initiatives in the shared mobility space. We are open to new partnerships and business models to leverage the advantages of the shared economy. Last but not the least, the safe zone. We believe safety should not be determined by disposable income. Safety needs to be and has to be, in particular in India, affordable. Because safety is a prerequisite for sustainability mobility in the future. I am proud to say that we are the pioneer in safe vehicles with the Ultras and Nexon being five-star rated, while Tiago and Tigor achieving four-star safety rating by Global MCAP as the safest vehicles in their segment. <laughs> Tata Motors has entered its 75th year in 2020 with a rich legacy in contributing to the nation and today. To celebrate this moment, we are fortunate to have our group chairman, N. Chandra Sekaran, with us to share, his, to share his vision for Tata Motors. I will now invite him. Chandra, please, the stage is yours. Hello, Gunther. <coughs> Colleagues from Tata Motors, friends from media, Ladies and gentlemen, connected aspirations, responsible and sustainable solutions is a national priority. With 2% of the vehicles from India on a world scale and 11% of the accidents, responsibility becomes very important. 14 out of the 15 most polluted cities, being in India, we cannot emphasize the importance of sustainability. Tata Motors is pushing the envelope along with other Tata Group companies. On safety, as you know, we have both Nexon and Ultras being the safest vehicles in their categories. On sustainability, while well, we have launched two models since we launched the Tigar in 2017, Nexon last week, at least four more products coming in the next 18 to 24 months. But more importantly, sustainable solutions, building it is not about building passenger car vehicles or commercial vehicles. It is an ecosystem. As a Tata group, we have been able to leverage the entire power of the group and bring in seven of our companies to build the entire ecosystem and solutions to deliver a world-class ecosystem for electric vehicles. This is just a start. We expect to invest continuously to expand this, to drive EVs and sustainable mobilities in India. Today, with the BF6 coming up, we showcase one of the largest portfolios of vehicles, all BF6 compliant and upgraded, both in performance and design elements across the board in CVs, PVs, and EVs. Hope you will get to enjoy what you see today and be with us through this journey. Thank you so much. Thank you, Chairman. And a very good morning, friends. It feels wonderful to connect with you today. 2018 was a very good year for the commercial vehicle industry. However, 
in 2019, we have been impacted by unusual mix of industry cyclicity and several disapproving non-cyclical factors. While none of these are in our control, we chose to change what we could and deliver more from less. All this while, our focus has been on increasing engagement levels with the customers, dealers, and all other stakeholders in the ecosystem to understand and address their pain points and expectations. Let's start with customers. Customers buy comfort, and they don't just buy products or services. We lay strong emphasis on customer comfort and had launched Sampurna Seva in Auto Expo 2018. Sampurna Seva, which is a comprehensive package that addresses all after-sales needs of the customers. This has now been upgraded to Sampurna Seva 2.0, leveraging our extensive network of more than three times the nearest competition. The key highlights of Sampurna Seva are, first is now we are delivering guaranteed turnaround time at all our workshops across the country. And second, a very unique, unique in the world, breakdown assistance service called as Tata Alert, wherein we promise to reach the breakdown site anywhere in the country within two hours. And we assure to make the vehicle back on road within 24 hours. Consistent delivery on these service standards have led to a very high level of customer satisfaction. Let me speak about other stakeholder, that is the driver. At Tata Motors, we recognize that commercial vehicle drivers, whom we refer to as Sarathis, Bhagwan Krishna was Sarathi for Arjuna. So we call commercial vehicle drivers as Sarathis. And they form the backbone of transportation industry. We have understood their pain points, and we have launched three novel flagship programs to improve their quality of life, because we believe we ought to do this for them. And their positive response to these programs have vindicated the path we have chosen, and we feel satisfied with it. Let me now spend a few minutes on the electrification journey in commercial vehicles. We are proud to be part of the government's electrification of mass mobility. We have already supplied 215 electric buses in five cities under FAME Phase 1 program, which have already covered cumulative mileage of more than two and a half million kilometers. Yes, two and a half million kilometers. FAME Phase 1 has not only about supplying buses, but also about enabling the setup of necessary charging, maintenance, and support infrastructure, which has ensured an uptime upwards of 95% in each city upwards of 95% in each city over 2.5 million kilometers. Going forward, we are committed to pursue the government's mass mobility electrification drive by participating in the FAME Phase 2 programs. Leveraging the rich experience that we have gained, we are now expanding our commercial vehicle, electric commercial vehicle portfolio. And today, we are unveiling two products. One, a 12-meter low-floor electric bus, and the second, a 9-ton ultra-electric truck meant for last-mile distribution. First time from Tata Motors. So this was about electric vehicles. Let me now speak about the BS6 range from Tata Motors. We do recognize that our customers' expectations are fast-evolving due to the changing business scenario. To meet these expectations, each and every BS6 product has been conceptualized and developed to deliver on three prioritized attributes. And these attributes form 
part of the most important purchase decision making criteria for the customer these three attributes are delivery of best in class operating economics second is comfort and convenience in the product as well as service and third is enhanced connectivity using the connected vehicle architecture which will help the customer manage the fleet and the entire transportation business better at tata motors we treat each regulatory change point as a value enhancement opportunity for our customers increased axle load norm is a case in point where we delivered increased value for the customers our bs6 range goes beyond mere regulatory compliance and delivers enhanced value to the customers either by improving the total cost of ownership or increasing the revenue earning potential today we are unveiling the entire range of bs6 trucks buses and power trains consisting of 14 vehicle exhibits ranging from sub 1 ton as to 55 ton prima in goods transportation a 15 seater winger to a 55 seater lng bus in passenger mobility and two next generation turbotron engines coupled with the bs6 range and the technology upgrade we are also in introducing our new premium tough design philosophy this will characterize our cv range blending premium and aspirational designs with tough and robust looks with a clearly identifiable visual dna this new design philosophy celebrates traditional tata motors values while demonstrating our vision for market leadership in the future too let me now introduce the new winger the new winger is our latest offering in the mass transit space and a sophisticated and comfortable commuting experience for modern and urban passengers on the design front it combines elements of premium tough with impact design 2.0 philosophy which has been taken from passenger cars presenting the new winger what happens when dreams meet their destiny when words meet a tune when passion meets will when comfort meets convenience when trust meets aspirations when road meets destination sheer magic happens meet the all new winger that comes with bold new aesthetics where premium tough design philosophy combines with impact design philosophy of passenger vehicles ultimate comfort and convenience offers lesser cost of ownership because of better fuel economy and lower maintenance cost tata's connected vehicle solution that offers fleet management trip management and business management services at a click and comprehensive protection and care with sampurna seva tata winger sapno ki winger wow pratap that's a fabulous job yes media friends i have borrowed pratap now for commercial vehicles also and that's one of our offering in passenger mobility now let me move to goods transportation the new prima new prima our flagship truck range is the leading carrier our of our premium tough design philosophy The new Prima boasts of a state-of-the-art next-generation cabin that provides enhanced safety, comfort, and convenience, 
as well as host of connectivity features. The new Prima comes with power-packed drivetrain of Cummins 6.7 liter 300 HP engine with all the advanced technologies and only selective catalytic reduction technology that assures robust durability and reliability through the life. Friends, the Cummins 6.7 liter engine sitting in the Prima is the largest selling engine in the world in six cylinder and above category. Yes, that's the engine in Prima. So friends, presenting the new Prima BS6 range. Every time we build a truck, we ask ourselves, what's ahead? Design, what's ahead? Tough roads, what's ahead? Comfort, what's ahead? Technology, what's ahead? Environment, what's ahead? Safety, what's ahead? Presenting the all-new Prima Range. Ahead with a lower cost of ownership. Ahead with premium yet tough looks. Ahead with comfort and convenience. Ahead with Tata Connected Vehicle Solution. Ahead with Sampurna Seva. The all new Prima Range. The way the world trucks. So friends, I'm sure after seeing these two vehicles, you will agree that commercial vehicle business can be equally glamorous. Thank you so much for being with us here. And may I now request Gunter to take us through the PV story. Thank you. Well done. Thank, uh, thanks, Girish. While it is certainly not easy to go beyond uh, the chairman's speech, it would be much easier to actually take Girish's speech to the next level because we have a lot in store in PV. We have gone beyond BA6 in the passenger vehicle business with significant enhancements to design, safety, driving dynamics, and technology. This 15th Auto Expo is a very special one for us. It's going to be a new era for Tata Motors. We are new today, and we want to be new forever. Today is just the beginning of the new forever. Please recall it. We have refreshed our entire portfolio. Tiago and Tigor, and our compact SUV, the Nexon, becoming the only manufacturer to do so in just one go. The year 2020 has begun on an extremely exciting note for our passenger vehicle business. We recently launched the Altros, and it has received a tremendous response. Altros is the first vehicle based on the Alpha Arc, stands for Agile, Light, Flexible, Advanced Architecture. And to show the proof of the Alpha Architecture's capability, let me begin the unveil of our four beauties with the first showstopper of the day, the HBX SUV Shoka, a product which will define a completely new segment, offering a stunning package of true SUV design, nimble performance, and class-leading space in an extremely small and compact footprint. Presenting the HBX SUV concept,
if you don't mind, let's go on with the show. In order to do so, I would like to invite Celish to join me on stage to talk about our next concept, the so-called Alpha Architecture, or on the Alpha Architecture. We present to you a legend reborn of a product that was India's first lifestyle SUV. It made us, better to say most of you, to sleep under the stars, go beyond the roads to places you could uh, only dream of, light campfires in the middle of nowhere, and almost becoming a second home. But today's concept car goes even beyond. Being battery electric, leveraging the Alpha's capability and Ziptron's modularity, it is green and pays back to the nature. Reimagining the Sierra back to life. The Sierra, the Sierra concept, a tribute uh, to our German Emeritus, Mr. Ratan Tata, who actually launched it the first, who unfortunately could not join us today. Let us unveil the Sierra Reborn concept car. I hope you like what you see. I hope you confirm rather under-promised and over-delivered. Selesh, thanks for joining me Thank on you. stage and let's move on. Tata Motors SUV brands have always been iconic. Our next concept is a soul stealing combination of two of our most loved SUVs. The iconic Safari is renowned for its tough go anywhere attitude. This made us to expand the concept of Safari, taking it across all 4x4 vehicles. What better than the ultra-capable Hexa to take forward this legacy and transform it into an extremely alluring concept? Let me present to you the Hexa Safari concept, the teaser of the Hexa 2020, which will be available later this calendar year. Over there! Let's now move to our second architecture, the Omega Arc. Optimal, modular, efficient global architecture derived from Land Rover's legendary D8 platform. We start with the first vehicle based on Omega, the Harrier. Launched a year ago, it has been a great journey ever since we went with the Harrier. 
Here we are with the Harrier 2020. It now comes with a six-speed automatic transmission mated to the next generation 170 horsepower B6 diesel engine and also has a best-in segment panorama sunroof along with a host of other features. Harrier B6 is open for bookings and will be available with our showrooms after the 20th of February. Presenting the all-new Harrier 2020. I know it gets boring consistently being asked the same question, isn't it exciting? Yeah. Yes, I know it is. But I would like uh, to take the excitement even to the next level as we present our flagship SUV. Going beyond the Harrier is difficult, but this global SUV is a true personification of being powerful, indulgent and capable, crafted to enrich your lives. Presenting to you the all-new Gravitas. I was told that my closing remark is supposed to take place on the center stage. And I'm lost. Where is the center of gravitas at this point of time? It doesn't matter. With all our, all our new range of SUVs, we promise to go beyond and to be new forever. I urge all of you to walk through our pavilion, spend quality time engaging with our beauties and exchange ideas to help us being better at what we are, in reimagining customer delight and experience, and in contributing towards nation building as highlighted by our chairman. Thank you everyone for joining us today. Have a lovely Auto Expo 2020 and spend as much as time as you have with Tata Motors. You're always welcome. Thank you.
friends from the press, please hold on. We will give you sufficient opportunity to photograph each individual vehicle, all your favorite people. We will give ample opportunity. So don't worry. Just hold back a little more patience, and we will have ample opportunity to photograph. Just relax. Hold on. Each and every photograph, each and every product, we will give an opportunity to, uh, for all of you to have your time. Now I request our Chairman, Mr. N. Chandra, and our MD, Mr. Gunter Butchek, to come onto the stage and pose for photographs. Please join. Now I would request you to move to the HBX. request you to move to the winger I would now request the XCOM to join along with Chairman and Gunter for a photo opportunity, please.
please stay back linger around look at all our vehicles from up close and definitely definitely check out our green zones